for taste. It's an excellent choice. Watch it all for taste. Break this shit up. Yeah. All right, we're well, we making up for taste today. We're gonna have one. Uh, well, this is the first pumpkin beer of the year. That's right. This is uh, what is today? Today is September the 16th, 2019. And uh, yep, gotta start off with pumpkin. That's right, the pumpkin. This is the Imperial Pumpkin Ale. Uh, it says pumpkin pie in a glass. We'll see. Uh, six point. I'm sorry, eight point six by volume. And uh, let's see what else it says. Pumpkin Imperial. Uh, vintage, okay, here's a date. It says 176. I'm, I'm assuming that's Julian. So whatever 176 is, maybe I'll put it up there. If not, you can figure it up. Uh, at 2112. Uh, yeah. So that'd be what? 20. What's that? 21. That'd be uh, well. 20 would be 10. So 9:12 in the evening. All right. Cool. They tell you right down to the last minute, don't they? Uh, what else we got here? We got uh, buh, 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 nothing cool, but uh, yeah, their normal label, right? Got the little pumpkin right there, pumpkin with a little king thingy on there, and uh, yeah, Southern Tier. By the way, I don't know if I said that Southern Tier. Let's go ahead and pop it open. I love, uh, you know, this time of year we always get all the all the pumpkin beers, and there's a couple really good ones. Are kind of hard to do, and there's already one in there, isn't it? Um, kind of hard to, uh, you know, taste them all. There's always so many of them, but you got to at least start off with. I got pumpkin and uh, what's the other one? Anyway, this is always the best one usually. The uh, the one I always look forward to every year. So let's go ahead and uh, pour it on in there. See what we get. All right, get your little head up on it. Hmm. Yeah, and always you get your, oh, by the way, it's a two-finger head, nice head on it. Nice uh, amber, slight caramel-y um, look to it. You got a slight hazy, nice carbonation bubbles coming up from the bottom. Like I said, slightly hazy. Um, and the head, I said it was two fingers, and it's uh, really nicely tagged, uh, uh, nicely packed bubbles. And just a little off-white, maybe eggshell type of color. Yeah, looks great. Uh, look at that. Like I said, it is uh, September the 16th, a little warm still. I think today was 94, 95 degrees, uh, so it's really not fall, um, but uh, eh, time for a pumpkin beer, right? Let's go ahead and smell it. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's that's pumpkin. That's, wow. I mean, it does get that fall smell to it. You smell this, and then you really want to get into that fall season. Oh, man. You know, you get all those nice fall smells. You get a slight little bit of maybe some cinnamon, nutmeg. Oh man, that smells good. All right, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and taste it. Yeah, but like, like I said, for pumpkin beers, this is usually my go-to. This is the one if I'm going to get a pumpkin beer out somewhere. Pumpkin is the one to to, to get Southern Tier out of. Uh, was it like uh, I guess west southwestern uh, New York State down below Buffalo? I actually, no, believe it or not, I've been not to the brewery, but in that area. That's, I've got relatives. I got a, a cousin that lives right near the brewery. My grandmother lives in Buffalo, so we're all right there. So next time I visit her, by the way, I'm going to visit her. I think in uh, February. Her birthday's in February. Maybe while I'm up there, I'll get some uh, some good beers by Southern Tier. But uh, anyway, yeah, great beer. I mean it. There's not much you can say about it. It's got the nice nutmeg smell. I mean, it smells like pumpkin pie. If you, um, if you get a slice of pumpkin pie, that, that's the taste. I mean, you don't, I don't know how to get any closer pumpkin than this. Yeah, you know, maybe a slight, slight boozy at the end. You said, is it what, 8.6? So yeah, I mean, it, you know, 8.6 is going to get a little boozy, but uh, man, this is great. This would be great to sit uh, around the fire, drink some of this. Mm. Good stuff. Anyway, from uh, Southern Tier down in uh, the southwestern point of uh, New York, and uh, off taste, this is Pump King. Peace.
Hopefully these people are getting the idea. Look, folks, it's like this. If you don't work here, if you don't sleep here, you don't sleep with anybody that works here. Well, Dennis, they only have one choice to matter, don't they? Well, that's, that's his choice. Get the hell out!